Now we need to create a site. So this site is going to be called the HQ Learning. And now I'm going to confirm that site. A connection wiring diagram does pop up to make sure you did understand how the connections should have been made. You can do do not show again. And then once you understand this, click got it. Now we need to enter the MAC address of our bridge, which is printed directly on the top of the box on the label. And then click on confirm. You see here it has found a bridge device, the bridge ID, this number, the 2761, or whatever your number is for your bridge, will match the label that is also on top of the bridge where you found your MAC address. Once you confirm that's the correct bridge device, simply select confirm again. Upon confirming, it's actually reaching out and looking to see does this bridge device need an upgrade before proceeding. So this device does need one, so we're going to go ahead and let that automatically upgrade by clicking on the upgrade icon. Now we get a prompt that tells us it is upgrading. Do not power off the device or reboot during this process. You can choose to sit here and watch this complete. It takes about one to two minutes or you can select the got it if you wish to complete some other task on your PC while this process performs. And once the update is complete, you do get the prompt that pops up to let you know that your device is now up to date and simply select on the word got it. So now that our system is up to date, we will simply click the next icon. 